Yeah! Big League! Ball number one! Ah! Me! Run! Okay. Huh? What? It's turning for some reason. You're right. Where is it going? Huh. Even I don't know. My Big League ball changes direction at will. Just like Miyuki Kobayashi in Red and White Year End Song Festival! Wow! You really are cool, Samomo! Ah, uh, what's wrong, me? The bonsai my father cherished. Ah! Miss! I bought the bisco you asked for! Too bad, Inazuka. You know, I'm sorry! Inazuka, sorry. I apologize too. W what happened? Ah! Uh, the bonsai that dad cherished! <laughs> Mr. Inazuka, you've messed up! This is bad, even for Mr. Inazuka! Man, you're doomed! You're doomed! Eiji? I yes? What the hell were you doing? What? Well, I was just having a Mario party in my room. You... I told you to watch the girls while I went shopping! Oh, I did watch them, you know, with my evil eye. With your evil eye? Stop messing with me! Heiji, you broke Dad's bonsai tree while playing catch the other day, didn't you? You were forgiven last time, but who knows what'll happen this time, huh? I'm sorry! Please, don't tell Dad! Please, help me! You're asking for mercy, even though you made fun of me that much? After I tell Dad, I'll make sure to punish you myself! You'd better brace yourself! Please, please help me! I burned off all of Heiji's hair on his shin. Then I turned him into Dad and made him apologize. Dad is very generous, so he accepted his apology. Well, I guess you could say it was also because it happened while his daughter was playing with her friends she had made for the first time. It's always been difficult for her to make friends just because her father was the head of the gang. But I was told to go find a bonsai that was better than the one dropped and ruined with Heiji. I now have extra work because of you. Oh, you really are so kind, Mr. Inazuka. Huh? You know, because you apologized to Dad with me. You're a sweetie, Mr. Inazuka. Burn. Huh? Ah! I burned not only his leg hair, but also the hair that protected his privates. He really is useless. Heiji and I end up searching for a bonsai day after day after day. The bonsai itself is easy to find, but it's hard to find something that will impress Dad. <sighs> what should we do? As I'm walking around, wondering. Hey! Stop messing around! Uh, ouch! It ain't hurting! If you don't want any more pain, get out of my way! Sis, no! You can't take Grandpa's precious things! He's too old to notice! How good a girl are you? I won't allow you to take Grandpa's things without permission! I came across a fight between sisters. I didn't want to get involved in a fight between sisters, but... If you're not gonna move... What are you doing? Put it down! <sighs> Prepare yourself! The one who looks like the older sister starts to raise a golf club. Stop it! Huh? Who the hell are you? If you don't get out of my way, I'll do you too! Oh yeah? You really think I won't do it? I'll prove you wrong! Yeah! Whoa! What? What did you just prevent it with? Something broke? Wow! Ah, my beautiful girl's figure toy's neck broke! What's going on? Should I call the police? No, no, call an ambulance. Damn, it's going to be a commotion. I'll let you off the hook for today. Don't you forget this. With that, the older sister ran away. Thank you very much. Don't thank me. You can thank her. This girl who saved your life by having her head chopped off. Uh, Miku, it was brand new. Thank you, Miku. I want to thank you both too. You don't need to thank us. Oh, yes. Yes? What is it? If you see a nice bonsai, let me know. A bonsai? Miku! Hey, come on, let's go. Mr. Inazuka, please wait. At least let me bury Miku. Uh, I have another job. I'll bury you. Uh, then, hey, do me a favor. What? Me? Bury Miku for me, please. Yes, all right. I owe you. Be careful. Thank you so, so much. It's fine. I'm grateful for her too. Uh, come on, we're going. Roger. Uh, I don't have time for this. 
I have to find a bonsai soon. I'm getting busy with other work. Dad was at the end of his rope when I was at the financial company I run. Ah, Mr. Inazuka, thank you for your hard work. Yeah, ain't there anyone who comes in with a bonsai tree to cover a debt? No, there isn't. While talking like that, I hear a yell from the back seat. Just lend it to me. I'm the one who told you to lend it to me. No, I can't. You don't seem to be working. You don't have any money to pay me back, do you? I told you I have a way to pay you back. My grandpa is sick right now. I'll inherit from him soon. Even if you say so. <laughs> if you won't listen to me, I'll do this. <laughs> what are you doing? I look closer and see that it's that sister from the other day. She's trying to pour coke on my precious employee of my company. <laughs> <sighs> Just in time. Mr. Inazuka! Thank you so much. Don't get in my way! Wow! My poster of Miku! Oh, Eiji, you're here? I found the bonsai we were looking for, so I came to report it to you, Mr. Inazuka! Oh, great. Hmm, why the teary eyes? I'm not happy at all. My Miku is soaking wet! You know they say a woman who can drip coke is a beauty, right? No, they don't! Why do you have my stuff in the first place? Uh, you want me to tell you why? Yes, tell me! You broke my car emblem the other day when you were swinging your bat, didn't you? Uh huh? How did you know that? Our lady told me. Uh, I didn't do it on purpose! I don't care if it was on purpose or not, but you tried to hide it, didn't you? That's why I took the precious things in your room. No way. Even for a Yakuza, there are things you can and can't do. You're the last person to say that! I'll sink you if you're not careful. Uh, please forgive me! Y Yakuza? Shoot! I'm out of here! No, hey! Wait! Man, you let her get away. Hey! Someone bring a knife and a cutting board. I'm gonna shred Heiji's little finger. Hey! Stop! Stop! I'm sorry! Get back here! Uh, it's tough every day having a clown as a subordinate. But he's surprisingly competent. A week later, we decide to go see the bonsai Heiji had mentioned. Here we are. Hmm. Haven't we been here before? You saved the girl from getting attacked the other day, remember? Oh, this is the house from back then. Excuse me. Yes? Oh, Mr. Heiji. Hello. Hello. Sorry for barging in all of a sudden. No problem. Can we see your bonsai? Uh, sure. We are led into the garden, and there it was. Oh, it's a magnificent bonsai. I'm sure Dad will be satisfied with this. Right? Right? I'm capable, aren't I? Praise me! Ouch! Seriously, you get carried away too easily. Are you sure we can have this? Yes. To tell you the truth, the owner of the bonsai, my grandfather, passed away the other day. He gave it to me three days before he passed away. But I have no knowledge of the bonsai. I don't know its value. So please take it with you for free. I owe you for saving me the other day, too. No, that ain't how it works. If you let us have it, we'll buy it at a fair price. All right. And with her permission, I take a picture of the bonsai and showed it to Dad. He was overjoyed, as expected. I immediately contact the owner of the bonsai and transfer the money. I know she must be going through a lot after losing her grandfather, so I sweeten the pot a little. A few days later, Heiji and I decide to go pick up the bonsai. And when we got to the house... Hey! Give me Grandpa's inheritance! There isn't any! You're lying! That's how you, Mom and Dad, are going to get your inheritance, right? No, you're wrong! Oh, but... But what? There is a person who bought this bonsai. He said he already transferred the money. Let's split the money amongst ourselves. That'll do, right? What? This tree isn't worth much money! 30,000 yen is the best it can do! 30,000 yen! Even if we split 30,000 yen among the four of us, it's not much. No. Ugh! This tray is really annoying! This tray is in the way! What are you doing? Uh, it broke! Who cares if it's broken? This had a 9 million yen appraisal on it. What? 9 million yen? You're kidding, right? No, I'm not. The guy who bought it sweetened the pot and paid 12 million yen for it. 12 million yen? No kidding. It's true. What should I do? They're supposed to come and get it soon. Oh, I know. Why don't we just stick them together with Aaron Alpha? What? That way they don't know. 
There's no way they're gonna know. They will, you can't do that. We can't sell this, I'll pay them back. You really are a goody-goody, Misa. Some dumbass who doesn't even know the value of things is gonna come anyway, right? It'll be fine. Hi, I'm a dumbass who doesn't know the value of things. Huh? You guys are the Yakuza from the other day? Oh, Mr. Inazuka and Mr. Heiji. Are they the people buying the bonsai? That's right. Oh, here we go. We'll give it to you. Isn't that broken? No, it's not. That's funny. Then take your hand off that thing. Oh, well. Can't you let go? I can, but I'm kind of emotional to give it to you. You're sure it's not broken? Of course not. It's broken. So get back the money. Misa, what are you talking about? Why would it be broken? Sis? Okay, then. I'll believe you that it's not broken. Yes. Okay, Heiji. Let's take it home. Roger. Hey, get out of the way so I can take it home. You're in my way. Oh, well, I can't move away. Just let it go. I can't. Ah, oh, fine. Let's just take the whole thing home. Right. What? You're kidding, right? If you don't want us to, let go. I want to, but I can't. Then I guess I'll just have to carry it like this. Stop it! Wait a minute! With that, we carried the bonsai as it was. Oh, that's a magnificent bonsai. Hmm? What's with the woman? It's an accessory. Just like the extra you get with Glico. An accessory? Oh, never mind. I like Glico. I'll make it a routine to look at this every morning from now on. AG, take good care of it, will you? Yes, sir! Water to start off with. Especially a lot of the accessory. Yes, sir! If anyone breaks this bonsai, I'll chase them to the ends of hell and drown them in Tokyo Bay. Hmm? Is the bonsai shaking? I'm sure it's just your imagination, Dad. Yeah? Well, of course, Dad knows she broke the bonsai. He's just playing along with our bad joke. Not knowing that, she keeps holding the branch in her hands, freaking out. We decide to leave her be, but rain or wind, she never let go of the branch. I told her to give it up already, but she just wouldn't let go. That's a lot of guts. It's no surprise. A few days later, she was rushed to the emergency room. I went out of my way to prepare a meal for her, but she was too stubborn to eat. What happened to the woman was, after being discharged from the hospital, she came to me again to hold the branch. But I told her that if she was going to do that, she would work to pay back the 12 million yen. This is enough, right? That's exactly 12 million yen. Huh? Where did this money come from? It's none of your business! You'll let me get away with Tokyo Bay now, won't you? I will, but are you sure you're okay? That's none of your business! Sure enough, it seems she had borrowed 12 million yen by running up black money. She tried to overdraft, and although she got away with Tokyo Bay, she was drowned in a bathtub. After all, it doesn't change the fact that she borrowed money from Yakuza. After that, as for that bonsai, its skin was connected. So after much effort, it managed to return to its original shape. Beep beep! Form a line! Let the second Uwazagumi dodgeball tournament begin! Yes, sir. I won't lose. What? I will win on my team? <laughs> then, it's okay. Help is on the way. My long-standing intuition tells me so. Oh. Hey, G, you son of a- Oh, it's Inu! Inu, you're on my team! See? Rin, your help came, right? Oh, after all that's happened, you're still gonna play in the yard again? And the fact that it's the second... Was it the first time the other day by any chance? No, oh, well... Inazuka, let's just play. Oh, but, miss... Yeah! Big League Ball number two! Oh, wow! Well, it flew to the direction of the day after tomorrow! Oh, my dad's bonsai. Yeah! Oh! Inu, you're cool! Inazuka, great save. You're pretty good. Huh? Mr. Inazuka, that's my life-size figure toy of Miku! Why are you using that as a bat? Wow! Miku's neck! I hit it with something boring again. Okay, the ball went flying, so let's play dodgeball with Miku's head! Stop it! Yeah! Big League Ball number three! Ah! 